Hello friends, this video sequence and series part 12 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched sequence and series part 1 to part 2. Now we'll introduce some of terms of GP. Some of terms of a GP is written by Sn is equal to A 1 minus R to the power N by 1 minus R or A R to the power N minus 1 by R minus 1. Both are same actually. So Sn I'll write here is nothing but A into 1 minus R to the power N by 1 minus R. Or we can write the same thing in this form A into R to the power N minus 1 by R minus. So here normally when R is less than 1 we use this and R is more than 1 we use this because P are more comfortable in dealing with equation which are positive. So here A is first term and R is the common ratio. Please note this formula Sn is equal to A into 1 minus R to the power n by 1 minus R. It's very very crucial formula. With this we will solve a lot of questions. Now we will try to prove this formula. We will prove this formula by induction. To prove this formula by induction what we have to do let me first write the formula S is equal to A into R to the power N minus 1 by R minus 1. So to prove this formula by induction, we have to first assume prove that this true for N is equal to 1. Prove. Assume that this is N is equal to K, this is true. We'll assume this. And then we have to prove that this is true for N is equal to K plus 1. For this, we have to prove. Thus, if we prove that this is true for n is equal to 1, we assume that it is true for n is equal to k and then we prove for n is equal to k plus 1 it is true. That means that formula is true by GP. So, let's prove this for n is equal to 1. The term will look like this as in a, a r. will be the term. Now when you say s of 1 that the, it should out, it should come out to be 1 a. So we do put n is equal to 1 in this we get a r to the power n 1 minus 1 by r minus 1 that is a into r minus 1 by r minus 1 and this becomes a. So that we have proved for n is equal to 1. Now let's assume that for s equal to k this is true. This is true that means a r to the power k minus 1 by r minus 1. This is true. This is equation 1. We have to prove that s k plus 1 is equal to true. So s k plus 1 is nothing but s of k plus t t of k plus 1, correct? This term summation plus another term you add that becomes s of k plus 1. So this is nothing but s of k is a r to the power k minus 1 by r minus 1. This is s of k plus t k plus 1 is equal to a to the power r k plus 1 minus 1. Because T n is nothing but A r to the power n minus 1. So T of k plus 1 is A r k plus 1 minus 1. So this becomes A r to the power. So what we will do? We will take r minus 1 comma. So this will say A r to the power k minus 1 plus A r to the power Correct. Now we will expand this or this I will get sorry into R minus. That is what we will get. So we expand this but we get A R to the power K minus A plus A R to the power K plus 1 minus A R to the power K by R minus 1. This and this is cancelled. So what we get here is 
a is common 1 this is minus 1 plus r to the power k plus 1 by r minus 1. You can also write this as a into r to the power k plus 1 minus 1 by r minus 1. And that is nothing but s of k plus 1 using formula. So this is LHS, this is RHS. So both are same. Thus we have proved that this formula is true using induction. What we have done? We have proved that s of 1 is true. We have assumed that s of k is equal to 2. That is s of k is equal to a r to the power k minus 1 by r minus 1. This is what we have assumed. And this is our equation 1. Then we have used this formula. That is s of k plus 1 is equal to s of k plus t k plus 1. And then we have solved this to get the answer. Now let's try to prove the same thing using logic. So here we know that s is nothing but a to the power plus a r plus a r square plus a r cube plus a r 4 plus a r to the power 5 dot 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 a r to the power n minus 1. This is the last term for s n. This is s n. We now will rewrite this by multiplying into a. So we'll write a into s n. A into a, sorry, r into s n. We'll write r into s n. A into r becomes a r. Correct. Then a into r into a r become a r square. R into a r square become a r cube. This becomes a r4 dot dot dot. This becomes a r to the power n minus 1. And this becomes a r to the power n. What have you done? We have first written s n and then we have written r into s n. So every time we will get multiplied. a becomes a r, a r becomes a r square, a r square becomes a r cube, a r to the power n minus 1 becomes a r to the power n. Now we will subtract these two equations. So this becomes Sn into 1 minus r is equal to LHS will become Sn into 1 minus r. RHS will become this and this cancel, this this cancel. All these will get cancelled. So this will become a minus a to the power r. That is a into 1 minus r to the power. So you can say Sn is nothing but a into 1 minus r to the power n by 1 minus r. And that's our answer. Very simple. What we have done, we have taken Sn, we have multiplied Sn with R, we have ordered this equations, and then we have subtracted these two equations to get RHS equal to Sn into 1 minus R and RHS equal to A into 1 minus R to the power N. And we got this. Let's take one example of GP, sum of terms. So we are told to find sum of 5 terms of GP of series this. So here we know that a is equal to 1. To find r we can divide this by this or this by this. So when we divide 2 by 3 by 1 by 1 we get 2 by 3. Similarly when we divide 4 by 9 by 2 by 3 you can get 2 by 3. So r is equal to 2 by 3. So we know a we know r. And n is equal to 5. First 5 terms n is equal to 5. Simply we can use this formula sn is equal to get this formula a into 1 minus r to the power n by 1 minus r. So we'll get this a is equal to 1 into 1 minus r is 2 by 3 to the power 5 by 1 minus 2 by 3. Or we get sn a a is 1 into 1 minus 2 by 3, 2 by 2 by 3 to the power 5 is equal to 1 minus, this becomes 32, 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, 32 by 3 to the power 5 is equal to 243, and this becomes 1 by 3. So what you get? 1 into, this you subtract, you get 211, 
by 243 and this will get into 3. So what you get is 211 by 80 and that is our answer. Very simple what we have done. We have found the value of a, r and n and then we have simply used the formula s n is equal to a into 1 minus r to the power n by 1 minus r. We have put all the values to get s n. We will take one more example. So here we are asked how many terms of the GP 3, 3 by 2, 3 by 4 are needed to make sum as this one. So here also we know A is equal to 3, R is equal to 3 by 2 by 3. We can divide these two equations 3 by 2 by 3 that becomes 1 by 2. Or we can divide this and this, we will also get 1 by 2. So R is equal to 1 by 2, N is equal to we have to find. And we are told that Sn is equal to 3069 by 5 1. We have to find the value of it. Simply, we can use this formula Sn is equal to a into 1 minus r to the power n by 1 minus r. Or 3069 by 5 1 2 is equal to 3 into 1 minus r is 1 by 2 to the power n by 1 minus 1 by 2. Correct. So this becomes 3 into 2. This will become 1 by 2. This will go up into 1 minus 1 by 2 to the power n. Correct. This is 1 by 2. So this will go up. Now we can cancel this also. So we just write this 3069 by 6, I will put this here, is equal to or by, by 5 into 5, 1, 2, this is equal to 1 minus 1 by 2 to the power n. Then I think I have put 6 here. Now when you solve this, what you get is 6, I can divide. This is divided by 3, so I will so divide by 3, 1, 0, 3, 2, the 6, 3, 2, the 9, 1, 0, 2, 3 by this one. So what I get is 1 minus or or I'll just say 1 by 2 to the power n is equal to 1 minus this is 1 0 2 3 this is equal to by 1 0 2 4 so 5 1 2 into 2 is 1 0 2 4 and this is nothing but 1 by 1 0 2 4 or 1 by 2 to the power n is nothing but 1 0 2 4 we can say as 1 by 2 to the power 10 or n is equal to five. What we have done? We know a, we know r, we don't know n, we don't we know s n. We just use the formula. S n is equal to a one to the one minus r to the power n by one minus r. We use this formula. We have put the value of n r. We put the value of r and a. Solve this to get the value of n. We'll take this. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.